Hey guys, what's up? Um, I'm here for my February favorites. Um, first of all, I just want to say that I can't believe February is over already. Like, where has this year gone? Um, I'm going to start with my non-beauty favorites. And so I have it on my iPod right here. My favorite movie for the month of February. Um, I have two, actually. One of them is The Perks of Being a Wallflower, which came out on DVD. And I've watched it like five times since it came out. And I I forgot how much I love that movie. Um, and my... Um, 2012 favorites, I listed um, Steve's movie, um, Seeking a Friend for the End of the World, as my favorite movie of 2012, but I completely forgot about Perks, and I have to say that Perks was actually my favorite movie. Um, I I just, like, can't explain how amazing it is. Like, if you haven't seen it yet, you have to see that movie. It's just amazing. Like, go rent it, go to Redbox, wherever, find it, rent it, watch it, you'll you'll fall in love with it. Like, honestly, it's seriously one of the best movies ever. Okay. Um, and my other favorite movie for the month of February is, um, The Giant Mechanical Man. Um, it's a movie, um, directed by Lee Kirk, which, who's married to Jenna Fisher, and, and it stars Jenna Fisher, and, um, Chris Messina from The Mindy Project, and, um, I just actually finished watching this movie last night for the second time, and I loved it. Um, Jenna Fisher is really great in it. Um, I love it because I can relate to it a lot. Like, I found myself really strongly relating to Jenna Fisher's character in the movie. And, um, it's a good movie for those of you who've ever felt lost and don't really know what you want to do with your life and not really sure what you're meant to do and just kind of have your life is like a kind of a mess and you don't really know what you're doing. Then this movie is for you because you can, it's just like, I could totally relate to it. Okay, my favorite TV show for the month of February. Um, I have two. One of them has been Scandal, because Scandal is amazing, and um, The Carrie Diaries. Um, I hope it gets renewed for another season. Um, you guys need to start watching it, because it's seriously amazing. One of the best shows on the CW, and like, um, I think more people should be watching it, because it's the cutest show, and yeah, you guys need to start watching it, because it's really amazing. Even if you never watched Sex and the City in your life, like, you, you would probably enjoy The Carrie Diaries. Like, you don't need to watch Sex and the City to enjoy this show. Um, yeah, you don't need any history with the series or anything like that. Like, it's a totally new show on its own. So, yeah, check it out. Mondays at 8 p.m. on the CW. Um, my favorite song for the month of February is probably Telescope by Hayden Penetier from Nashville. Um, I really love her songs on that show, and I love Hayden on that show. She's so good. Um, if you don't watch Nashville, you should definitely check it out. Um, Hayden is amazing on it. I love her character whenever she's on screen. I'm just, like, glued to it because she's just so good. Um, <laughs> okay, for beauty products for the month of February, um, my favorite lip product has actually probably been the Buxom Lip Gloss in the color Samantha. It's this really pretty pink color. It's a pale pink color and I really love it a lot. And yeah. Um, I love the Buxom um, lip glosses a lot. So yeah. Um, my favorite face product is actually, of course, as always, CoverGirl's Nature Lux Foundation. This is the only foundation I've used for like the past like couple years I think. Like I, this is just like the only foundation I use. I just love it um, a lot. Um, it gives great coverage and it's very light. And um, yeah, I, this is the only foundation I use. I love it. Um, now my favorite blush is actually Pinched. It's Pinched by NYX. And um, I love it a lot. It's a really pretty like pink color. And it's shimmery and it's really pretty. I really like it a lot. I use this a lot. This is probably the blush that I use the most. And um, I actually just purchased my Dusty Rose one that I showed you in my um, NYX, in my Ulta haul. Um, and I, I'm actually wearing this one right now and I like it a lot as well. Um, but yeah. Um, I don't know if you can tell, but yeah, I've gotten a lot of use out of this one. So, okay. Um, my favorite eyeshadow for the month of February. Um, I've been reaching for my MAC eyeshadows a lot. I actually have these on right now, too, because the colors go really well. It, they're really neutral, natural, like, everyday eyeshadows, you know? Um, especially all the glitters, which is like a light, shimmery brown. It's You could wear this on the lid every day of your life. I mean, it's really an everyday eyeshadow. Perfect for the lid. Um, and Satin Taupe, which is like, kind of like a... I don't, I don't know how to really describe it. It's kind of like like a plummy brown color. Um, but, yeah, it's kind of like a dark plummy brown color, I guess. Um, but, yeah, I wear these two together a lot um, lately, especially. Um, so, yeah, those are my favorites for the month of February. Um, yeah, I didn't have too many this time around. But um, those are the standout products for the past month, the ones that I've been using the most. Um, 
So, yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, feel free to post a video response below with your February favorites. And, uh, yeah. Alright, <laughs> until two days later. Alright, bye guys. <laughs>